If you're typing phone numbers into Excel like this one highlighted in yellow, but you want it to look like the one below with parentheses and dashes, then here's how. It's called a custom number format. And what that means is when you type these 10 digits all in a row, you will get a result that looks more like the one at the bottom without having to manually add parentheses and dashes. So here's how we do it. We're going to click back on this 10 digit long phone number that looks messy. And we're going to go to this number group up here at the top. Within this, I want you to click the down arrow here on this drop down list and all the way at the bottom, select more number formats. From here, we're going to stay in the number tab and then select custom all the way at the bottom. Now, what we're going to do next is in this type box where it says general, we are going to delete that and type our custom number format. And it's going to look like this. We'll add a parentheses and then we'll add three hashtags for the start of our number, close our parentheses, and then a dash after the dash, the next three hashtags, one more dash, and then the last four. And now what this means is if you insert 10 digits into the cell, you will get it formatted like this. If you have more or less than 10 digits, that might make this look a little different, but we're assuming we're using 10 digits for this phone number. We can then hit OK and you'll see that we have a proper phone number format here. If you want to go even further with this, where some phone numbers are formatted to have that little plus one at the beginning for the international code, we can again click on the cell, go back into the custom number format that we were just at, and at the beginning, you just add plus one, and then hit OK. And then once you make this format, if you have a long list of phone numbers down in this row here, all you're going to have to do is select this format painter and then you can highlight the area you want to copy over or click on the column header and now every single cell in this column will be formatted correctly. So for example, if I click on a random cell down here and type in a form phone number and then we hit enter, it will be properly formatted as a phone number. If you didn't already know that and wanted to drop a like, that would be awesome. And if you have any questions or comments, you can let me know and I'll respond. Thanks for watching.